Hello and welcome to The All Flyers. Pilot Gary Arthur saw an unusual aircraft in a hangar and just had to inquire as to what it was. And this was designed to fly over the Ho Chi Minh Trail in Vietnam. And they did. They flew this thing 400 feet over the ground at night and nobody knew they were there. It was an unusually rare Lockheed Y03 Quiet Star. Just six aircraft survived today. These were developed from the Schweitzer 232 powered glider. The Quiet Star is an American single engine propeller driven aircraft that was developed for battlefield observation during the Vietnam War. Designed to be as quiet as possible, it was intended to observe troop movements in near silence during the hours of darkness. The YO3A was designed to a United States Army specification of 1968, which called for an observation aircraft that would be acoustically undetectable from the ground when flying at an altitude of 1500 feet at night. In 1966, the company built two QT2 quiet thrusters. The prototypes had a silenced engine and a slow turning propeller for quiet operation. Following operational trials in Vietnam, a production aircraft designated the YO3A was ordered. The YO3A had a large wingspan and a larger canopy area for observation. Two crew members, a pilot and an observer, are seated in tandem. The observer is located at the front of the cockpit. The YO3A is an all-metal low-wing monoplane of semi-monocoque construction. The control surfaces of the YO3A, including the ailerons and rudder, are fabric covered. The engine cover, canopy, engine exhaust shroud, wing root fairings and wheel well fairings were constructed of fiberglass. The YO3A has retractable tailwheel type landing gear. This aircraft was powered by an air-cooled six-cylinder horizontally opposed fuel injected Continental model IO360D engine. The engine is coupled to a slow turning propeller through a belt pulley drive system. The three bladed laminated constant speed wooden propeller has a reduction ratio of 3.33 to 1. The engine cowling and firewall were lined with fiberglass material to dampen and contain engine noise. The aircraft was equipped with an asymmetrical exhaust system. The exhaust gases are moved through an acoustic fairing into a dissipating and resonating muffler, continuing to the aft of the fuselage. Nine of the 11 aircraft produced operated in South Vietnam at night from 1970 to 1971. And although three were destroyed in crashes, none were damaged by enemy fire or shot down. The observers in this aircraft were very successful in spotting movement by the Viet Cong and North Vietnam Army operating in South Vietnam. Observation were initially made visually, about 80%, later followed on with a night vision aerial periscope developed by Xerox Electrico Optical of Pasadena, California. The aircraft operated silently at 1,000 feet or lower depending on terrestrial background noise. Some pilots were known to have gone unobserved over the enemy at 200 feet. Occasionally daylight flights were made over the rivers. Crew chiefs would monitor the aircraft by having it fly over maintenance section prior to deployment, listening for rattles, whistles or other noises. The propeller even at 500 feet over the maintenance area, made only a light flutter, heard just as it approached. This was followed by a light rushing of wind over the wings. There was no audible noise once the aircraft had passed over. After Vietnam, two aircraft were used by the Louisiana Department of Fish and Game, being effective at catching poachers. The FBI eventually acquired the aircraft and operated the type for several years, assisting the apprehension of kidnappers 
and extortionists. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Donations always appreciated.